Hey, hello everybody, my name is Kadema, welcome back to another video of Total War Three Kingdoms, the new DLC that came out, which is called Eight Princes. We're continuing with our series here of uh, Sima Hei, I believe his name is. Let me check really quick. What's his name? I uh, forgot. Uh, Sima Hei, yeah, I got it. I got it right. So, we're a prince. We can be emperor, all this uh, stuff. This is uh, basically our main focus. I kind of forgot already uh, um, did the mods and everything. I I did check out how to switch or how to change my whole setup so that I th my voice is not going to have a fucking echo finally on my video, you know. So everything's going to be perfect now, or it should be at least. You're going to hear uh, sound if there is sound. You're going to hear my voice perfectly. That's going to be great. Now, my mic is on its uh, period I call it that because my mic decided to that it has uh, white noise behind it so that the, the static basically I, I can't do anything about static except really bring down the volume a lot so that's the one thing I can't change uh, for some reason uh, my my mic decides that it has static on it every few uh, ever so often so we can't have everything right we're at war with these guys right here. We're at war with on these guys as well. Uh, I'm going to take out one at a time. We're going to take out this uh, little place here first. Um, let's be really quick. Uh, I'm going to upgrade my town really quick. Right here, large town. And we're going to try to bring it to the city. Uh, we got a new stuff here. We're going to get uh, this thing right here. It's going to give us a public order basically. That's really good. We only have one army so far, and they are not fully healed up just yet, so we really do need to wait up on that, to wait up for them to be fully healed up and everything. Um, let me just see, we got something right here, oh that's uh, a reform, yes. So reform, we're gonna just use this one right here, there we go. And what should I do really? Uh, actually, let me check something out really quick. All right, so yeah, I want to get rid of that thing so that my troops actually recover faster. For some reason, my troops won't recover uh, if I don't do that. So uh, this place is on claim. This place is on claim as well. Do I need to? There's one thing here. I can get an administrator. Any of these two. I'm going to get the best one possible. There we go. Just get an administrator because it's going to be really important. There we go. Um... I guess I should put it in uh, Shangxi, our capital city. There we go. Uh, we do have a son. There we go. He's two years of age already, so that's really good. We're pretty high in reforms, actually. That's really good. I want to see really quick if I can't, like, raise another army. Can I... I can get an assignment here. So, reformation, nope. We want wealth or income. I'm going to get uh, wealth here. Let's try to get another army. Can I? Yes, I can build another army. So that's what I'm going to do. All right. What I'm going to do is I'm going to get a new army right here. That's going to go into the south. Uh, we're going to need at least two armies here. So that's what I'm going to do. And also, they've got there's a lot of places here that are not, are basically uh, not taken. So we can take them for, ourse uh, for ourselves. Uh, lumber yard. Oh, yeah, let's take all of that. Who should I go for here? Um, I'm thinking maybe a melee uh, unit here could be really good. Seems like he's a really great soldier. We don't have. Oh, we do have somebody here, which is a legendary character. So we're gonna pick him up since he's legendary. We might as well. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and put him in this city. We're gonna recruit a bunch of soldiers here, guys. So let me just recruit three, uh, three extra, I guess, army or uh, generals. We're gonna get one for the uh, the range, and we're gonna get another one for, I guess, the melee and everything. So there we go. Now the range unit. Look at the uh, look at these units she has. Yo, that's crazy. Mounted crossbows and everything. Huh. So they're basically, yeah, these ones are on cavalry. So these are cavalry units. 
I don't know if I like that, to be honest. Uh, I don't really want the cavalry units so much. I think this would be better for us right here. So archers of uh, wing or whatever. Yeah, definitely better. We're going to get these ones. Uh, one, two. At least one, two. We've got three melee units right now. One. Can I get rid of these? Hold on. Can I get rid of these? Yeah, if I disband the unit. I will just uh, disband the unit. I'm going to get uh, the cavalry from this guy. Uh, swordsman and everything we don't have. The best option would be this guy. These ones. Okay. So we're going to get... I think this guy is a cavalry unit already. So three cavalries should be enough. Uh, we do need two catapults though. That's uh, that is one thing we're gonna need before I get the catapults. Though I do wanna get two more melee units. He's gonna be the one popping up the melee units in here. So maybe I should get these guys, huh? Melee power. See, this guy has better melee power, but his melee toughness is lower, I believe. Yeah. What do I want? Melee toughness or melee power, guys? You gotta let me know which is better, basically. I think melee toughness is uh, way better. So I'm just gonna put that out. There's four units right here. Four units for the range as well. Uh, we got here. So let me see real quick. I think I'm gonna put the cavalry in here. Uh, not the cavalry, the two catapults in here. We're also gonna pick up more units. So one, two again. And another one, two punch here, which is right here. One, two. All right, so six units of each. We've got two uh, catapults. We've got three cavalry if you count the general. We're gonna get another cavalry just to be sure. And I guess we can get, um, what we could get is another uh, melee unit really yeah we could get another melee unit or another cata uh, catapult no just another melee unit should do the trick so yeah get another melee unit like this and this is going to be a really good a really good force here it's going to go on the south while this guy takes care of lingling right here we're going to wait for them to build up completely uh, so this one's going to go here and here this one's going to basically go around this region, take what's unclaimed for ourselves. Uh, let me go ahead and go to the diplomacy stuff. I want to make sure that I'm friends with a bunch of people. We're friends with the Jin Empire, obviously. Uh, trade territory? No. I kind of want to... I wanted to see if we can get anything out of him. It doesn't look like it. Uh, can we get anything out of these guys? maybe like uh, some neighborhood or something maybe uh get some food or, uh, or stuff they can give us something so request food per trade uh, food trade duration i'm going to request some food here give me just five food per turn and uh, we should be good yes the food were good it's actually money well money doesn't matter money we're almost uh, we always take it make it back anyway so let's finally end the turn go into the next one Right, well, we're two people, like I said. Let's go and see how it's gonna go. A non aggression pack of Sima Yue, uh, minor prince, he's one of the princes. So, we will sign a non aggression pack. I don't know, I'm gonna reject. I don't want any non aggression pack for now. Uh, we're gonna keep it slow here. Um, I mean, if I if there's an objective that tells me to attack this guy, then I have a non aggression pack, it's gonna be pretty bad. So, I, I want to prevent that from happening. I want to make sure that uh, everything's good. All right, on to the next turn. We're gaining t uh, gold now, which is really good. Hopefully nobody declares war to me. Or the Empress decides to uh, doesn't decide to give me something. Faction development, Buddhist selflessness. True alignment comes not only from inward focus, but also outward generosity and thoughtfulness towards others. A pure gift given be with pure intentions or pure recipient is the very essence of generosity. A new year begins, a new opportunity to steer your people towards their destiny. Okay, interesting. We've got uh, two places, two regions that we can, uh, actually three regions, I believe, that we can upgrade, I'm not sure. Uh, let me see real quick. So we're gonna upgrade this. Actually, this, this does not upgrade the population growth. Okay, 
But you know what? Doesn't matter. I thought in, in, in the previous, because I'm playing the other one too. Huh. Noble support, huh? So, what does give me the noble support then? I do have noble support from the hen. Okay, well, I need a yellow one, so I'm going to do the same one, I guess. Reformation. There we go. Doesn't matter, really. Uh, this guy is getting an army ready right now. He's, yeah, he's got an army on his city. We got to be careful here. Uh, this girl, the court, no uh, court noble. She seems like a good one. Uh, she upgraded cunning. Do we want cunning or resolve? We're going to get some resolve here for her. There we go. We're going to get our new re reform, basically. What do we want to go for? The art of espionage? Sure. Let's do that. All right. Seems like he's going pretty fast on this one. Oh, shit. Look at it. Now I know everything. I just uncovered everything. That's crazy. I didn't know uh, anything at all. The fog of war just disappeared. I probably unlocked something uh, that uh, helped me out there. There's a... Egg I want to see that. Trader. We got an ex uh, ancillary or whatever. Okay. Let's. Uh, now we know everything around us. That's pretty good. Uh, I think we're held up pretty nicely. We can probably go ahead and uh, get after this. Uh, these guys. This is still undefended. I kind of want to get it for myself, but my troops are not ready yet over here. Um, what should I do, guys? I think I should probably start attacking with these uh, this guy and uh, save up uh, the my second army for later because they're not ready quite yet. This is uh, quite a big army right here. So this might be a big battle right here that's uh, just waiting for us, really. Waiting for us to... Uh, waiting for it to happen. So let's go ahead and do our first battle of the video. Let's see. We've got decisive victory. So we all need to do it. Uh, we're not going to do this battle because uh, there's no point. 600 only. There's uh, not a lot of them. So let's just destroy them easily. We're going to get this little uh, place or region or whatever. There we go. We got. We lost 68 soldiers only. Uh, that's fine. We gotta occupy this place. There we go. Faction secession for that one. A faction destroyed. Oh, we just destroyed our faction. So, all right, there. Uh, we got the entire region as well now, which is really good for us. We got an upgrade for our our faction leader. I don't want that. I want to do that. So, what should we bring it? Uh, authority, basically, a lot. Yeah, he really does need uh, quite a bit of authority. So that's really good. Uh, we do have another upgrade. Oh, this guy as well. This general. Let's see. Uh, Taylor. I'm going to give him the Taylor thing. There we go. Um, we also want to give him authority or instinct. We're going to give him authority, guys. Let's go. All right, good. So we're just going to skip another turn because uh, my second army, like I said, is not ready to move just yet. They're not. At least uh, wait for them to have uh, at least uh, almost completely their, uh, their army done. So former coalition with Sima Zhuang. Um, he's a uh, warlord. Minor prince as well. Okay. The former th uh, coalition established a non-binding agreement to fight mutual enemies. He's going to give us that. Um, where, is the, uh, where is he in terms of uh, all this? Sima Zhuang, where are you at? I want to see where you are. I don't know. I got to figure it out uh, on the map, guys, because this is going to be hard. Yeah, I got to figure out where he is. Oh, he's right there. Okay. He's all the way over there. He's way too far for me. He can't, uh, so there's no point in me f asking for anything. I don't want to get into any sort of military alliance. No, thank you. I'm good. I'm good for now, guys, because... Being in a military alliance or a coalition or whatever, is no. There's no point of me doing that if I'm not uh, exactly um, n a neighborhood country to the other one uh, that's asking me to be a coalition. You know, I need to at least be a neighborhood, uh, neighboring uh, place. Otherwise, there's really no point because usually what I do is they ask me to do stuff. Fine, you give me a territory in exchange. You know, something like that. 
All right, bunch of wars being declared right now. Uh, at least <laughs> we are not be declared. Uh, we're not being declared war upon. A remarkable talent. A man comes before you possessed. He uh, he insists of a remarkable talent. He claims to know uh, Chen Shu's records of the Three Kingdoms by heart. To prove it, he will tell your character's tell for a price. Whose uh, whose story would you like to hear? Okay, what would that that's give me bonus? So cunning and sister of the prince, the tiger general. So that's uh, enlightenment, whatever. Bonus experience. It's all bonus experience, anyways. Uh, enlightenment or might. The greatest warrior in all China. I'm gonna get might. There we go. There we go. That should do it. I don't know what kind of bonus it gives me exactly, but we'll see. I'm going to get that as well for here. And for this region right here, we're going to get, I think, this right here. Nice. All right. My army now pretty uh, pretty much ready to move out, guys. That's good. Uh, we took out this place. Uh, upgrade for this guy for some reason. He didn't, do, he didn't get it into the battle. After the battle, he, got, he gets it now. Uh, some resolve here. That's really good. Let's move him out uh, again. So like uh, I said in the last video, previous video, we're going to do uh, one city at a time that we can take only. So let's take this one. Decisive victory. Delegate. We don't need to do the battle at all. It's only if it's at medium uh, casualties or high casualties I'm going to do the battles. It's going to happen at some point, guys. Don't worry. We will eventually get a, a fight or something, a battle, but it's just for now we're starting pretty strong. Uh, they really need to heal up at some points, but we're fine. Okay, so this we're starting to get a new region, a third region. I think this unit can take care of my princess unit, leader unit, can take care of the south. Uh, I'm really going to move out to the east with this unit right here. And start claiming this unclaimed territory here because otherwise other people will and I don't want to lose my chance here so let's just go uh, start that up guys oh boy the frames are dropping big time right now what the hell all right let's just let's go can I go there there we go man the frames are really dropping big time right now what the hell's going on guys okay let's go it's taking forever for that unit to do it to move out come on game don't crash on me you're good you're good game don't crash now all right establish order let's go we got a new city uh we we've started with the city as well which is really good there we go we can we have a new assignment available another assignment but i don't have anybody to assign to that particular thing so really good really uh, really quick we're gonna see ownership wise this is us. We just took that right here at uh, this city. Um, I want to see. So what's gray over here is all the things that are, are unclaimed. So all this is unclaimed. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, all of this is unclaimed. And all of this as well. Taiwan, as you can see right here. Which is really interesting. All of this as well. There's a lot of unclaimed territories here. And imagine if we can just get all of this for ourselves. Plus... All of this basically we're gonna destroy this faction and get all of this little region for ourselves that's really gonna be good for us that's gonna be awesome all right again that's fine uh, prince wise so all these are princes we're all princes that's crazy there's a lot of us all righty then uh, what's my ranked my next friend is gonna be a uh, grand prince we're almost there in terms of points we're almost moving up, guys. That's uh, crazy. Anyways, let's continue. We got a new reform that we got to do. So I'm going to do this one, I guess. Uh, sh shibing system or shibing system. I'm not sure how this is, how it's called. But uh, we, we don't really have anything else to do right now. So we can move out or move on to the next um, turn. Let's go. All right. We got a bunch of wars declared here. A factions have been destroyed, guys. The peace treaties as well uh, here and there. There's a lot of stuff happening. We got a noble birth. Uh, a second. Oh, two. Actually, two childs. That's really good. The shabbing system. Really good. 
Uh, let me see those two childs. We got two new children. Oh, actually, it's just one? Really? It told me there was two children. I guess I just well, I got one. So another son. We got our three-year-old son right here and our newborn baby. Really good. Really nice. All right. Let's continue to upgrade our, our, our places here and there. Uh, we're going to upgrade now. I think we're going to upgrade this for the food. Food is going to be really, is really important in this game. And we're going to upgrade this right here. Anything else that we need to upgrade? Uh, I think Luling. We do need to upgrade this one. Um, I can't uh, get any of this. So what I might do is just get the food or whatever. Just get that. Yeah. Okay. So these guys are fully, are fully done really. They're uh, all maxed out on health. That's really good. We're going to start moving out with this guy right here. So we're going to take out this city first or this uh, lumber yard first. Let's go. Let's take it out. No uh, easy battle right here. High casualties for them. Decisive victory. Let's go. Uh, oh yeah, we didn't lose any people. That's really good. The armies are bigger in this uh, this game. and this uh, DLC, which is really cool to see. Because the armies in the previous, the original uh, mod or whatever, the original campaign, they're uh, much weaker or much... Uh, like uh, they're not as uh, as long um, as big as them so there is a, an unhappy general in here which I don't like I don't like at all this guy is unhappy what about him what's going on with you buddy why are you unhappy I'm gonna give you something right here so you can be happy I guess he's not happy yet all right now he's happy now he's good all right so yeah just promote the guys that are not happy and everything and They'll leave you alone. Because I really need them to be happy right now. I cannot afford a civil war or anything. And this girl is not happy either. Man, they all want promotions. What the hell? What's going on here? Okay, a new reform. Obviously, we got to reform every, uh, every turn. Let's go. This one. Up to next, what we have, not really anything sp uh, particular. We do have to move out uh, this uh, general uh, general's army. This is unclaimed. They probably want to claim this place right here. So we're going to move out right away here to prevent them, to prevent them from going here, you know, because otherwise it's going to be pretty bad. Yeah, this army, for some reason, is really having a bad time. My friends are dropping every time I'm moving out this army. I don't know why. Like if things are going well for my regular army, with my uh, faction, uh, my actual faction leader, but for some reason this army in particular is not doing well. I don't know. Your power increases. I'm a uh, okay. So prince, yourself as a worthy power. Your achievements have marked you out as one to watch. But the Sima clan is vast. You will need to progress further if you have to prove yourself a worth contender for the regency. Of course, if you have little time for such titles and legitimacy, you uh, could always seek to put yourself on the throne by force. Now, I'm gonna. We're not gonna try force right now. We're good. We're upgraded. We got two new places. So, you know, we can take you here and get you, I guess, uh, in this place right here. There we go. And we're gonna take uh, this other general right here and uh, give him the chancellor position there we go see really good chancellor position and uh, yeah so we got all of this so far we're doing great we got uh, the console so he's got a mission for us we got a settlement so a settlement administration construct a, build a, a building so we got to construct that building in particular settlement administration we'll do that in the next turn show your strength so what is that exactly the empress seems overjoyed at your aggressive uh determination yes such spirit i have no doubt for you okay so she wants to capture and occupy this place okay good fine yeah no problem we are already we are already at war with them so that's the next area she wants us to take we'll take that but first we need to take out this giant army right here take out the only army they have actually because this is uh, really important. Uh, next thing 
our main thing is we need to get to um, Grand Prince level. Let me just see real quick. Oh, so we are Prince now. Oh, yeah, okay. So we just made it to Prince. Now we're going to try to make it to Grand Prince. Let's try to make it there, guys. Let's uh, go to the next turn again. All right, these guys want military access. Let's see if we cannot. Um, so these guys are right here. Let's, uh, are they attached to us? They are kind of attached to us. I don't think I can. I can get some territory out of them. Untradeable. Oh, uh, it's untradeable. So I cannot get any territories out of them. That's a shame. So if I can't get any territories out of them, I'm sorry, buddy. But it's not happening. We're not. Uh, we're going to reject that shit right, right away. Okay, we're in the next turn again. A bunch of stuff that's going to happen here. Some people got vassalized and everything. Uh, hold on. What was that? Faction development? Okay. That's the thing. Okay, that popped up. Okay, good. Control the capital. So we got a new thing. Uh, Imperial city. What? Capture and occupy the capital. The time has come. You have gained uh, sufficient influence that you can now make your move on the capital. Uh, conquest is the most direct route, but a diplomatic annexation may be also possible. Uh, annex annexation, huh? So they, the Jin Empire is actually growing pretty nicely, I gotta say. Um... That's the Jin Empire right here. That's pretty good. Uh, I'm going to go for the annexation, guys. I want to go the Pacific route. Pacific route. Uh, because right now, I, I can't afford... Well, I can afford, but I don't want to do another war for no reason. It's kind of uh, pointless to get so many wars one by one. Uh, one after the other right now. Uh, we're going to get this thing done. The one turn. But there is something we need to do, right? Which is... Um, Overpopulation? That's not the thing. Yeah, it is. Settlement administration. We gotta get that uh, somehow, somewhere. We're gonna get. We're gonna upgrade this first off. And in this region, there's uh, something here. So, where's that? Settlement administration. I gotta see really quick. Um, info overlay. Now that's not. That's not it. Show menu? No, that's not it. En Encyclopedia. Total War Acad Academy. There we go. Let's just go to the Academy. And see where we can find uh, what we're looking for here. Is that it? Yeah, yeah, got it, got it. Alright, so. Yeah, we're looking for... Let me search. Can we search here? We can't even search. What the hell is this? Uh, management, general, commandaries, this, spies, factions. We can't even fucking search. This is terrible. There's no point in doing that. Come on now. Oh, it's a, that's a waste of time. Okay, whatever, guys. You know what? Let's be, let me just get whatever. Yeah, I, I can't get anything. I can't... I don't know how to... Where to go to get that next level thing. So, I don't know what they want out of me. I'm going to just wait up then. Uh, I'm gonna wait up on that. I'm gonna. No, I'm done. I don't want to demolish. What am I doing? There we go. Upgrade that shit. All right. We're, we're gonna start by using this one right here. Uh, moving him out. Actually, this new stuff. We just we did get a new uh, auxiliary or whatever. It's woozy. Okay. Let's try to give it to somebody like her, maybe. That's really good. So you got a nice little bonus right here. All right. Let's move out. Get this next region right here. Wait for this army. This army is really uh, having a tough time with the frames and everything. All right, let's get this place. Establish order. There we go. That's easy, man. Easy, uh, easy takes for us here. So we got a new area too. New region. We're going to get that. Now, as it is for our army, we don't have time for a big battle. But we... Uh, so we're, I'm probably going to just wait for... Wait, last. Oh, they do. They have two big armies right here. Who's their faction leader? I need to see who's their faction leader really quick. It's this guy. Okay. So their faction leader is over there. That's our faction leader right there. Guzan. The Guzan. That's just another general. I'm going to just go ahead and go over here. Let's go. Move out, move out, move out. And we're going to attack them. Alright. We're going to attack them. 
This is a close victory right now, medium to high. I'm going to demand a surrender. They refused. Fine. We're going to be at war right here. I am going to um, I'm going to starve them out. Starve them uh, starve them out and we'll see how it goes. They've got a large town and everything. Uh, let's just see how it goes, guys. We're going to take out this region. We're going to have we're going to start the next video with a big battle between my heir and one of their generals. They've got a kind of a cute army here. We're definitely going to win. I've got a bigger army than theirs. A much stronger army as well. But it's just a matter of seeing uh, how it's going to go, really. We do need to get a, another reform, though. So let's get this one, mass mobilization. There we go. We're good. Uh, let's check on our court really quick. Everything's good here. Everything's going well. We've got everybody. We've got uh, two sons. One that's three years of age and another one that was born recently. This is our two... Uh, basically di direct brothers and everything so I can try to take them out or something but I don't want to do that right now Fenzu and okay hold on so these guys I might war with these two oh yeah these are two different enemies okay so this is a faction there uh, okay so this is a faction leader so we're gonna uh, we're gonna have two faction leaders uh, going after another guys in this uh, next video